We're gonna turn it on and we're gonna give you the power. We're gonna light up the dark night like the brightest day in a whole new way. We're gonna turn it on. We're gonna give you the power. It's coming down the line, strong as it can be, through the courtesy of the electric company. Electric company, here I am. So I'd like to express, oh, I got a base. I got nature's upright base right here. Whoa, I'm hanging out by a banyan tree. This is my company, darling. So I'd like to express that I really feel cover songs get a bad rap because of course it's good to write your own music that's absolutely feeling and authentic. It's totally good, it's totally you, it's totally true. I feel cover songs get a bad rap. I think every time you sing a song, obviously you're singing a cover song. And if you want to perform a song written by somebody else live because in some way you feel it expresses some part of you that either you haven't expressed or you're still learning to express or you just want to express or even if it's just like the melody or the harmony or just something that stands out wonderful I really really feel that it's fine if you really feel that another song is expressing a part of you it's totally fine to sing that especially if it helps you and helps you to know yourself more. Can even encourage you also to write songs if you would like to. And you could just continue to sing cover songs because it's totally fine. My point is is that I really feel that cover songs are getting singing cover songs get a bad rap. People sing a song, it's so beautiful. Did you write that? No, but I really, really also like really feel it and I can convey like, you know, my feelings explicitly and amazingly and very honestly through it when I do express that. I really feel that that ought to be looked at, that it, can, it really, really, really helps a person to bring out their feelings and even bring out their vocal strengths, singing along, well, singing along when you're learning it and then singing it, you know, on your own when you're performing it or just on your own at home. I think cover songs get too bad of a rap just because the person who is singing it didn't write it. But I think we ought to look at the way that the person is expressing it because that's really, truly the soul aspect of it, meaning that's like the quality and what matters. And I'm not talking about plagiarism, I'm not talking about like copyright things, I'm just talking about singing a song that you like just because you feel it. And it is good to write your own songs. I don't condone that, of course. I don't condone cover songs. It's wonderful. It is so fun to sing songs that move you. Just do it and let that be like the joy of it. And don't worry about like whether someone else wrote it or not. We all sing other people's songs. Mary Had a Little Lamb, baby! Did you write that? Well, heck. You know, A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Oh God, it just like goes on and on and on and on. Um, <laughs> So I just want to express that. It's totally fine to sing cover songs. And if you really want to write your own songs, go for it. And if you don't want to write your own songs, go for it. Another point I'd like to make is that there are so many songs that are ancient and elder and wise and just that go so far back that it is really, really good that those who hear them and resonate with them bring them out now so they're remembered so they're not lost so they're not just like covered in dust and forgotten by those who came before us who had love and wisdom and offerings to offer us and and things to leave us when they move on so please take these songs and this wisdom and to learn them and to carry them forth for you know so much is told in song so much is conveyed and brought forth in song and there's amazing things that are going on from the ancient times and times just any time before us um, there are songs that date way back that do need to be remembered I really really feel that there are some of us who are chosen to hear them and remember them and bring them forth I definitely feel that so that's another thing that is good it's good to bring out those songs that came from a long ago so that we'll always remember them and that they aren't forgotten and they're not lost so you hear them sing them bring them out and make them you know make them just so absolutely beautiful and when you feel a song 
and want to sing it, it's obviously because it resonates with a part of you that is you. So it's a good thing. It's a healthy thing. Please let's stop looking at the shallow aspect of it. You know, just this part where it's like, did you write the song? Let's please feel and understand that it's healthy. And look at the soul aspect of it. Thank you. Onion tree. Power.